Hi, Patreon subscribers. It's me, the person that you're subscribing to on Patreon. And I just wanted to address a few things. First of all, look how gorgeous my breasts look. There were some questions that you had for me and Miss Nikki Doll when we did a shoot together. Not so, not recently. <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna answer your questions. Are both of you in a relationship? <coughs> That's gonna be a no. What do you think is the best runway look of each other? So my best, my favorite runway look for Nikki is probably, um, honestly, I love her um, Cinderella look. Rate Nikki from a one to a 10. <laughs> oh my God. Nikki is a 10 out of 10 in my book, baby. Mary <laughs> Hill. Michelle Ross and Carson. Mary Carson, because I would spend the rest of my life with Carson Kressley. I would probably have to <laughs> Michelle because I've heard it's She's good in bed. I would have to probably kill Ross just because. Okay, are my extensions showing? I hope not. The Last Weenie, a book of poetry by Scarlet Envy. What look would I like to redo for my season? Comes from Millie underscore Deans. And I'll tell you what, girl, I would love to redo my Venus look because I just think I could like have different takes on it and I think it'd be fun. So that's what I would like to do. Favorite color to wear is red or nothing. What's, what's up with this? Oh it's my God, what is going on with this? So anyway, that's my pussy. You know, as a struggling actress, I have to suck dick to make t-shirts. So where are the dicks at? What t-shirts do you guys want? Let me know in the comments what merch you guys want to buy. Do you like enamel pens? <laughs> My favorite color is a brunette, like a chocolate brown. Gorgeous chocolate chestnut, gorgeous, gorgeous wig. And the worst color for wigs is whatever Tina Burner is wearing this season. Next. <laughs> What would your idea of a vamp and a lady runway look or makeup look be? Very classy. It would be like trashy, classy for me instead of vamp and lady. It would just be trashy and classy. There's two sides of me. And you should see what's in the middle. I had fun answering these questions and also we're gonna keep doing this. Um, also there is a behind the scenes uh, moment that I want to share with you guys from what I did with Mac. So I'm just gonna throw in a few clips here of my behind the scenes moments while I was filming my masterclass for Mac in Soho last week. We kept the eye very neutral and just used the Ruby Woo on my lip. What I'm wearing tonight is actually a liquid lipstick by Anastasia Beverly Hills in color American Doll with the same plump it up red MAC lip gloss on top. It's kind of like gives it this kind of brightness and like a pinkiness to it. Anyway, that is kind of similar to what I was wearing in this following clip, but I just wanted to give you guys the inside tea on what face we did, what we learned, and check out to see how it went. So I'm here in Soho because I'm teaching a MAC Pro class today and I just wanted to take you guys behind the scenes of what we're doing and give you guys the exclusive Patreon moment. Okay, guys. Yeah, yeah, follow along and then I like the way you guys do the overlay when the product is used just to do it. So this is just a little behind the scenes just for you guys on Patreon. This is not public information because you guys deserve the behind the scenes tea. These are some of the products that I was using today. This is the lash that I'm wearing by MAC. It is a 70, which is super sickening. With lip colors, which is also great. You can do the retro matte as well. 
bawah. All right, and that does it. Uh, a little uh, Q and A, a little bit delayed, a little update on my birthday cards being sent out. It is not too late to upgrade your subscription so that you too get a card for my birthday. Comment below with any merch items that you want. Um, ideally, nothing to be restocked, like all new things would be great. You guys are kind of my co-pilots here as patrons, so let me know, help me out, and let me, help me, help you.